All right, so again, let me read this uh, verbatim, it's important. Being a New Yorker and a proud supporter of Mayor Mike Bloomberg, when will you seriously consider making a run for the White House? You would be great, we need you, and I'd work my tail off to get you there. Well, thank you, Diana, for that question. <laughs> Uh, I am, uh, number one, I'm gainfully employed. I've made a commitment for the next 1,263 days, but who's counting? Um, and uh, I, mayors don't go on to other offices. People would say higher office, but I would argue that perhaps the best uh, political job and the best chance to individually change society is being a mayor, particularly of a big city. Arguably, the, being the mayor of New York is the best political job in the world. We have our own foreign policy. I've got the eighth biggest army in the NYPD. Uh, we've got a budget that's bigger than most countries' GNP. Uh, we've got more people that live in New York than live in the second largest city in the country they came from. Uh, so New York I I is really different. Uh, but mayors have to, unlike in my examples of pro-choice but not for women, uh, mayors have to explicitly say yes or no and be on the record and then have the press follow it and deliver the service the next day, not just promise the service. Um, and you don't make friends by doing that. Um, I am, and every one of my positions cuts out half the country. So I'm pro-choice, I'm pro-gay rights, I'm pro-immigration, I'm against guns, I believe in Darwin. Uh, it's down to Diana, my mother, and me left, and I'm not sure about my mother. <laughs> Uh, so there's not a chance that you could uh, get elected, um, and I have a commitment to finish out this term. Um, so if drafted, I won't run unless I really thought you had a chance to win. <laughs> Once again, you got to think, guys. Come on. <laughs> no, no is the answer. And if the press is in the back, it's not true. I'm not running. Make that clear.